so let, let us see this question we've already learnt one concept that is <coughs> positive why why do they show positive deviations as well as negative deviation what did i've also given you uh, important basic uh, um, explanation for that concept suppose if that is not exhausted in the exam they ask you in the form of question we've already seen one question for positive deviation where they've asked me to explain based on structure and polarity now let us see this question they are asking us solutions containing chloroform and acetone show negative deviation they said okay from raoult's law explain these observations in terms of molecular interactions now let's see they said negative deviation so when they give me negative deviation immediately i have to uh, focus on that concept what is the concept a b interactions or molecular interactions are stronger then a a and b b interactions this is what is the concept isn't it if you understand the concept you can write any type of question then now they've given me two co components here one is chloroform now chloroform is a so chloroform and acetone done anything you can take a and b let me take a as acetone b as chloroform let's write acetone here and chloroform now what am i trying to do i'm going to show the interaction is stronger i have to show this this is your acetone oxygen is partially negative now this is your chloroform chloroform formula we have written already in isocyanide test also ch3 cl chcl3 okay i the mistake i only did a mistake chcl done so 1 2 3 h here cl here cl here cl earlier i did ch3 cl is methyl chloride that's wrong ch cl3 is chloroform yes now this is your chloroform isn't it so what happens this chloroform this is partially positive a hydrogen bond forms between hydrogen bond forms between a and b so we very well know hydrogen bond it most important thing a and b that is your acetone and uh, chloroform are going to exhibit inter molecular hydrogen bonding so when they exhibit inter molecular hydrogen bonding escaping tendency tendency decreases why because hydrogen bonds prevents them to hydrogen bonds prevents them hydrogen bonds are stronger first of all that is important hydrogen bonds because hydrogen bonds are stronger because hydrogen bonds are stronger it prevents both these molecules to break and then vaporize that's why i said this stronger tendency is not allowing it to escape from the beaker this is your a b this is your strong and it will not escape that escaping tendency is difficult when it is difficult exerting pressure back escaping will also be difficult that's why it shows in the graph negative deviation negative deviation negative deviation this is your concept hence shows negative deviations that's it